This video is going to show you how to complete a Freire model with multiplication. So when you are working on this assignment, you're going to pick one of the facts that you've been working on. So if you're working on fours, you might pick a hard one for you, like four times eight, or six times four, or seven times four. One that you uh, may be work, still working on learning. And if you've learned them all, just pick the hardest one for you. And you will write in the middle, um, delete these words and type your fact and the product. So I'm going to do 2 times 6 to model with, and I'll go ahead and put the answer there, the product. And then I've got to show this fact four different ways. In this box, I'm going to do equal groups. Here I'm going to do array. Here I'm going to do a number line, and here I'm going to write a um, story problem. And I think the easiest way to do this is probably with Braining Camp. So you're going to go there get logged in with your school login that your teacher will share with you. And then the first one that we need is groups. So I think I'm going to, you can use all kinds of different things, but I'm going to try the two colored counters. And if you tap them, it'll, um, it'll add it. So I'm going to go ahead and add six. And I'm going to do two groups of six. And then if I select all of those and choose this little group button, it'll put a group around it. And then I'm going to do the same with red. And then I'm going to select all of them and put a group around it. Yours doesn't have to be with red and yellow counters. It doesn't have to look just like this, however you want to do it. Then the easiest thing to do is probably to click share, copy that image, and then go back over to your um, Freire model and do Control v for paste. And then you can, if you want to, you can crop it with this crop button here to get rid of the extra stuff from the website and you'll be able to make it bigger. So I'm going to crop that picture and then I'm going to increase, once I click off of it, I can increase the size and I'll have two groups of six. Okay, now I'm ready to move to the array. And for this one, I'm going to go back to Brainy Camp and click on apps and I like the color tiles one. So down here in the bottom right hand corner, there is a blank array that you can pick up right next to the, um, the text tool. And if you slide that out, then you can use this corner to adjust the array. So I'm going to do two groups of six. I'm going to fill it in all the way. I'm going to click share, copy the image, go back to my Freire model, control V for paste. And then I'm going to again crop that so that I have just the image and make it a little bit bigger. Easier to see. Okay and increase the size. Now I've got my two groups of six. For my number line, I'm going to use the number line app, which is right here. And for this one, um, the first thing that you want to do is change the range. I don't need a number line that goes all the way to 100. And so this down here is showing that my number line is going from zero to 100. So I'm going to click on that and say 15 is plenty because I know I only really need to go to 12. And then when I click off of it, it changes my number line to all the way to 0 to 15. Then I'm going to drop down one of these jumps and change it to 6. That would be one jump of 6. And if I click on that jump and click copy, then it'll show two groups of 6. And I, I need to see that I've landed at 12. So then I'm going to share, copy the image, control V to paste, and then um, crop it. All right, that's, I could crop out more if I wanted to. And then finally, for the last one, you will type a story problem right here. I have one um, that I did ahead of time, so I'm going to paste that here. I ran two days this week. Both days I ran six miles. How many miles did I run this week? So you can make it about anything you want to. Just write a story problem. All right, looking forward to seeing your for your models.